there are two types of graphics, bitmap and vector. Programs like Photoshop use bitmap graphics as their native, and applications like Flash and Illustrator use vector. Now in this video, we're going to learn the difference between these two graphics. Here we have the two different graphics set up on stage. There are two different O's, one is vector and one is bitmap. And I have clearly made this a little more obvious, but bitmap's quality looks a little more condensed or less than vector. This is because bitmap graphics use pixels and different shades of transparency or opacity to create the image. If I zoom in on here, you can clearly see that there are stair steps on this O. Once again, because bitmap graphics use pixels to create the image. After zooming back out, I'm going to zoom into the vector graphic. And you can clearly see this has a much better look to it. This is because vector graphics use points and math to calculate the distances between these points. These mathematical calculations give you a much better look instead of pixelation like in the bitmap graphic. That is why vector images are used more in animation. Let me zoom out back here. So again, bitmap graphics use pixels and vector graphics use points, lines, curves, and math. Now you may be asking which one is better, but ladies and gentlemen, of course, they are better for different purposes. Bitmaps are great for photo editing because they allow you to add a lot of effects to the image. And vector graphics are better for illustrations because they use, once again, points, lines, curves, and shapes. Now that you understand the difference between these two, let's get started working in Flash. 